The polymerase chain reaction, PCR, is a process used in molecular biology to amplify a single copy or a few copies of a piece of DNA across several orders of magnitude, generating thousands to millions of copies of a particular DNA sequence. Developed in 1983 by Carrie Mollis, PCR is now a common and often indispensable technique used in medical and biological research labs for a variety of applications. There are three major steps in a PCR, which are repeated for 30 or 40 cycles. This is done on an automated cycler, which can heat and cool the tubes with the reaction mixture in a very short time. Denaturation at 94 degrees Celsius, during the denaturation, the double strand melts open to single-stranded DNA, all enzymatic reactions stop. Annealing at 54 degrees Celsius, the primers are jiggling around, caused by the Brownian motion. Ionic bonds are constantly formed and broken between the single-stranded primer and the single-stranded template. The more stable bonds last a little bit longer, primers that fit exactly, and on that little piece of double-stranded DNA, template and primer, the polymerase can attach and starts copying the template. Once there are a few bases built in, the ionic bond is so strong between the template and the primer, that it does not break anymore. Extension at 72 degrees Celsius, this is the ideal working temperature for the polymerase. The primers, where there are a few bases built in, already have a stronger ionic attraction to the template than the forces breaking these attractions. Primers that are on positions with no exact match, get loose again, because of the higher temperature, and don't give an extension of the fragment. The bases, complementary to the template, are coupled to the primer on the three side, the polymerase adds DNT piece from 5 to 3, reading the template from 3 to 5 side, bases are added complementary to the template, this process repeated for 30 or 40 cycles.